up everybody, I'm Imoto with Packed and Crazy TV, here for an exclusive Dubious.org interview with James Schrader, director of a short film about money. How's it going? Yeah, it's going alright. Thank y'all for coming out. Yeah, thanks. Congratulations on your acceptance into the Atlanta Film Festival. Thank you, thank you. Is this your first year in the festival? Yes, first year. First year. How does it make you feel? Very excited. I'm, uh, you know, it's, uh, Something I've worked really hard on this project, and I'm glad that the Atlanta Film Festival recognized it. Yeah, it's awesome. So, a uh, short film about money is an animation. Yes, right? yes, it's I about a four and a half minute animation piece that I'd originally come up with in uh, in '09, and um, the idea was simply everybody was just broke, and I was just like, I just you know, I got fed up with. <laughs> I just got fed up with. Uh, this is how money just controls people so much and we're so motivated by it and you know, you know. So, I was like, I just want to make fun of it. I, uh, I knew right away that I wanted to um, scan in all, every denomination dollar from one to a hundred. Um, I mean, you know, I tried to get the 500, but I ain't really balling like that, so, you know. Do but they make a $500 bill? I think they do, they, or like a thousand dollar bill. But really? Yeah, they used to make, they used to make, back in the day, I did this research, they used to make like a hundred thousand dollar bill, and I think, who, yeah, Hoover was on it, anyway. So every denomination from one to a hundred, I scanned them in, um, front and back, and then a lot of the elements off from the dollar bills I incorporate in the film, like the, not to get all conspiracy theory, but the crazy Illuminati, all seeing eye yeah. pyramid, I use that. And um, when you scan that stuff through Photoshop, Photoshop actually popped up, like every time I scanned um, a different dollar and it said, you cannot reproduce this, you have to change this image before you're allowed to output it. Huh. Because uh, Photoshop knows. How did you come up with the script? Like, did you write it? Was there collaborators? Yes, uh, I wrote it with um, a good friend of mine, Daniel Pedersen. I initially just came up with it and he was like, you know, changed this and just, you know, came up with better jokes than I did. It's kind of a cross between Jib Jab and Monty Python. I really love, I wanted to kind of be like a found art object, you know, where I took, like I personally, I can't draw. But, you know, I can take things and like manipulate them really well through software. So, um, I really love that look of sort of a, a flat two dimensional uh, picture, but with that 3D depth that you can achieve. I find that like a lot of 3D animation, um, even high end Hollywood stuff, unless it's Pixar, to me kind of looks a little, I don't know, it's like they're trying to make it real, but it's just, I don't know, I have a disconnect with it where I feel like yeah. with flat 2D images, I think it engages the audience in a certain way. I want it to kind of look like it's animated crappy, but quite not, you know, kind of rim that, you know, that yeah. thin line between like where it looks kind of cheesy, but you know. What was the hardest part about your production? Uh, rendering. Render time, render time. <laughs> That's our downfall for all editors. <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah. Where can we go to check out more of your work? Um, I've got a uh, Vimeo page under my name. It's got a couple different things. Um, we have a YouTube page. If you just type in Sweet Gherkin Ensemble, just one word. What? Sweet Gherkin Ensemble? Yes. What does it mean? It's, it's about pickles. It's all about the pickles. <laughs> I'm not a huge fan of pickles. <laughs> <laughs> and so what are you doing when you're not animating? You know, when I'm not anime, I mean, I do, you know, all kinds of different filmmaking. I play a lot of golf, too. Okay. Love, you know, I'm getting older. I can't really play the high contact sports anymore, you know. <laughs> like, I used to be basketball dude, but now no, no, golf. It's a little bit, you know, it's easier and, you know, four hours and you can drink and it doesn't matter. Yeah. Drink and drive around in a golf yeah, cart. Yeah, you get a golf cart, it's great. new jokes. <laughs> <laughs> when you're not editing, when you're not playing golf, <laughs> when you're not animating, like what else do you do professional-wise? Uh, you know, I always view myself as a, as a filmmaker, so I do a little bit of everything. I, I like to shoot, um, I, like to, um, I like to write, and obviously love to direct, I mean, who doesn't? <laughs> but, um, you know, the, the, way, the reason I like animation and the reason I like post-production, not that I don't love those other things, is I just love the control of it. You know, that's what's great about editing and animation and um, that's why I really had a good time making this film was because 
you can control the entire environment. You can build everything up exactly the way you want it, which is also obviously why it takes forever. But um, it's a lot of fun. I mean, that's that's why I like editing too, because you know it was like Orson Welles said that one time you have absolute control of your films when you're editing. Cool. So what's next for? Sweet Gherkin. <laughs> uh, we're gonna we got uh, got a music video coming up, um, some short films, and then obviously we we all got the feature coming up. We'll see what happens. Hopefully, but <laughs> definitely definitely in the short term we have um, uh, Jay Quest, who's uh, partnered with us. Um, we have a new video coming out. He's got a new album. We're working on that. And then um, we got a short film we'll be working on in the next couple of months too. Cool. Well, thank you so much for meeting with us and talking about awesome. your film. And we'll see you at the festival. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Thank you again, Atlanta Film Festival. And uh, everybody come out. Short film about money. Short it's hot. film about money. Dubious. Dubious.